Hello, welcome back to Adventures in Pop-Ups. I am Rachel, this is Blake, this is where you come for pop-up camping, campground reviews, tips, tricks, hacks, mods to make your camping adventures awesome. Today, what are we doing? Today we got Frog Creek. It's a great little campground in Palmetto, Florida. Beautiful spot, so check it out and we'll see you in a second. Okay, so Frog Creek, we, I'm gonna say we liked it. However, there was like remnants of a hurricane passing through. So it actually rained almost the whole time we were there. So, Tropical depression. Yeah, is that what it's called? I think so. Okay, you know more than me apparently. It stormed for a couple days in a small pop-up. Yes, our pop-up was fine in case you're wondering. It did great. No leaks. Um, now, this is the point in our 12, 14 day trip that had like three different legs all over the countryside where we were starting to say, I wish we had a slide out. I am tripping over children. I am tired of being inside. This might be a little too small for us in our Starcraft. I specifically remember being at this place thinking maybe our camper is a little too small if it would just stop raining. Um, they have a lot of amenities. They have a pool they have really nice bathrooms we can, our our running joke was that the bathrooms were so nice they were nicer than our home bathroom um that that might have been before we remodeled our bathroom anyway they have a lot of amenities that we did not try because of covid and because of the weather if we go back i definitely would like to try the canoeing so this place is very much an rv park with like rvs just bam 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 we decided to stay in the place we did because it was right by the bathroom. It was right by the pool, which we didn't get to use. If we went again, where would we stay? In the back, maybe? In the back. That's what the owners recommended, they, they've too. They've got some tent sites. You, know, you can have a fire on the ground, and it's right back by a creek. So it's really pitcher, pitcher, picturesque. Picturesque. Okay. The front of the RV park is more like RV park, the back is more um, nature, there's a canopy of trees. So that actually probably would be, now that we have a bathroom in our camper especially, that probably is where we would try next time. I would love to try the canoeing. The weather just didn't work out. The reason we chose Palmetto, Florida is because of the location and proximity to our family. Other things that you might choose Palmetto, for, Florida for is proximity to St. Pete's and the beach we did make it to the beach one night it is our favorite beach we've ever been to it's our honeymoon spot it is our honeymoon spot <laughs> anna maria uh, island in anna maria and yeah it's holmes beach is the best holmes beach that's that's the main beach that's where the restaurant is and i think it's holmes beach cafe, cafe. holmes beach cafe is right there at holmes beach on anna maria island and they have great pancakes and sausage. All you can all eat. All you can eat. So if you want to get fat and sassy, that's where <laughs> you, that's where you go. Um, and then you know you got a great big beautiful beach, and there's a nice playground right close nearby, and you know miles and miles of beach. So and it does I get a little say, busy, but it does depends on when you go. But this is like sugar white sand. It is the most beautiful sand. We had such a great time in the waves and the sand. Uh, w most of our family, like our best family memories are at this beach, getting pancakes on the beach for people's birthdays. It's our family tradition. If you go to Palmetto or anywhere near there, 
You have to go eat though at, what's it called? Anna Maria Oyster Bar. Anna Maria Oyster Bar is our local favorite there. If you're looking to eat out somewhere, that's the place to go. They do have early bird specials. Early bird specials. That's where it's at. All you can eat fish and chips. Where are we going back? I would campground? say, maybe, I'm just going to say, four stars. I'm going to say four stars. A lot more trees, a little bit more picturesque. We didn't, we barely saw it because of the weather. That's yeah. not anybody's fault. It's just the weather and stuff being closed is just what it was for 2020 but i would give it i would give it four stars and it was a nice little place nice pool lots of amenities they had cable it, they had cable hookups too it is near quite a few mobile home parks trailer parks whatever in the area you don't get like people coming through or anything but just for your information like one way there's like park after park that's just florida though and then the other way there's a bunch of nature i think that price had full hookups Probably so check out Frog Creek Campground in Palmetto, Florida. If you like our review, if you like our channel, give us a like, a subscribe, check out our other stuff that we have for you to make your camping adventures more awesome.